This is where the game of baseball is literally a small grassroots movement. The infield of an old horse racetrack is now the home field of the Myanmar national baseball team. The club is a collection of part-time players with day jobs. They include maintenance workers, a teacher, a cook, and a taxi driver named Jothu Yatun. He's 33 years old, married with two daughters. I drive the car to work for my family and I play baseball because I love it. Toru Iwasaki of Japan, the founder of a local private primary school, started the team 18 years ago. The program gets very little financial support from the National Sports Ministry and depends mostly on money from Coach Iwasaki's own pocket to stay afloat. Surely I like baseball. I like the baseball and I'd like to introduce baseball in this country, spread more. This is my passion. Play ball! On this cloudy afternoon, the Myanmar national team is taking on a ragtag squad of expatriates from the U.S. and Japan. I like coming out with the guys and the camaraderie that comes out of it. Mick Amundsen Geisel grew up in America and works as a guidance counselor at an international school in Yangon. But today he's competing against the Myanmar national team, a club he occasionally practices with. It's definitely an American game, but it certainly has uh, Asian aspects here. Like the language that they use and the cheers that they do. But you get a sense of baseball's popularity, or lack of it here in Myanmar, by looking at the number of people in the stands. The team prepared a printout explaining the basic rules of the game in the local Burmese language to help fans understand the game. Few people are familiar with baseball in this country, where football, also known as soccer, is still king. People don't even know what this uniform is for. In other countries, people know this is a baseball uniform, but here it's hard to explain what baseball is about. For now, baseball is likely to remain a fringe sport in Myanmar, but this team is making its own contribution, promoting America's national pastime. Dave Grunebaum for VOA News, Yangon, Myanmar.